Just one drift, one drift, that's all I want. What is going on everybody, it's your boy Slab Train. Welcome back guys, Forza Horizon 2, Porsche Expansion Bucket List Challenge Part 2, man. Now last episode, we tried our damn hardest to complete this last number six one on camera. We couldn't do it, man, so I closed the episode early, and I got a lot to talk about today, including some comments from last episode when I was hating on the 914. Ladies and gentlemen, let's just make some stuff clear right now. Oh, boy. Jesus! That's not what I wanted. We gotta be clean coming through these trees, otherwise we're not gonna make this happen. We're not gonna be restarting a lot. Trust me, man. I got this. No problem. But, we had a couple comments though, uh, Miguel Tavares says you should respect the 914 slap, it's a classic. Now, I don't know if I made myself clear last episode or not, but it's not like I don't like the car in terms of, you know, say what it is, you know, I respect all makes and models, you guys know this, it's just, it's the least favorite of the pack, now I mean, you know, it's not the most appealing to me. You know, if you came to me and said, you know, Slap, I got a brand new 914. You want to buy it off me? I mean, I'd probably say, no, thank you. I'm good. Um, but that's just me, though. We are coming through these trees. Oh, my goodness. Now, I mean, for instance, I had a couple comments saying, you know, Slap, I've been, you know, trying to restore two of them. You know, why are you disrespecting them? It's not that I don't respect them, like I said. It's just they're not my cup of tea. Come on, man. We're close. We're close. Hopefully that did not put a damn damper in our time. And ladies and gentlemen, you guys like how I passed out last episode? For those of you guys that did come around... Oh my god. For those of you guys that did come around to the episode early, um, you guys got to see my epic fail in editing. Uh, for whatever reason, sometimes I hit control Z and my deletion of my clip comes back up, which happened. I had to get to some phone messages and a little bit of uh, the computer stuff, so unfortunately that edit was in there for the time being. I got it cut out later on in the afternoon, but damn, man, my apologies for that awkward silence. I watched it, I'm like, god damn, this is awkward, man. So I can only imagine how you guys felt, but I uh, definitely apologize for that. So, you know, sometimes, you know, in the editing, uh, you know, things just get accidentally left in. You know, it's not like I'm meaning to do it by any means. All right, we should. We should have this right now, ladies and gentlemen. 46 seconds coming up this hill, as long as we don't hit any other trees coming on up. Come on! Damn old Mackin Turbo, let's go! Now, if I'm not mistaken, there should be a shortcut up here that we can hit. We have 15 seconds right now, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, here it is, right here. I don't know. Keep left. In 100 yards, keep left. Oh no, I braked way too early. We may have this, ladies and gentlemen. We may have this. Even after those two screw-ups. Yes! Oh my god. God, I honestly cannot believe that I made that, even with the two screw-ups. We braked early coming around that S-Bend, and even still, we took that corner terrible. Oh my god, I'm happy that we just made that, man. Number six is down, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my god. Now, Crafty Cool says 276 miles an hour for both street speed traps combined. Now, he's talking about last episode... Um, when I was freaking out because I thought the game was glitching out, uh, no, it was two speed traps, ladies and gentlemen, uh, you know, I mean, you know, sometimes I just forget about that stuff sometimes, and I'm thinking, you know, just one speed trap, and, uh, yeah, so, with that being said, the game is not glitched out, I was glitched out, you know what I'm saying, oh my god, alright, so number seven up next is another hard one, unfortunately, but it says attack, the Autostrada and a Porsche Turbo S. I mean, I'm game, man. No problem. Where's the car at? Ooh. 
Oh, hello, beautiful. Oh my god, that thing looks absolutely gorgeous. Here we go, man. We have to get 75,000 skill score before we arrive. Let's do a quick little donut in the golf course just to show them that we can. I know it's a little bit harder in this all-wheel drive, but we're going to make it do. Grab some skill points as we go. But there was a comment that I wanted to touch base on from last episode. And that was, um, where was this here? It was a little bit of Chinese writing with a name of Concho. And he said that EA, or sorry, not EA, but Turn 10 really knows how to milk their customers. Now, you know, we've had a lot of recycled cars. I will give you that. Yes. But forget all that. Is this Porsche pack, you know, worth the money? Personally, 110% agree. Ladies and gentlemen, you got to understand the amount of work that goes into these packs. I mean, yes, we don't see a lot of the work. We just get to see the finished product. And I've always said this, that, you know, I think that Turn 10 really should, you know, show us what the hell they're doing on these daily packs to really open up people's eyes on, you know, what we are getting for this dollar amount. Because I'm going to be honest with you, 10 bucks for 10 Porsche cars is not bad and we also got to keep in mind you know the money that they've spent to obtain this license for Porsche is going to be absolutely huge you know they've probably dropped a lot of money on this now I really do not know any kind of dollar figures but oh thank god thank god man we didn't lose that but if anybody would like to try to take a stab at you know how much money E or sorry uh, turn 10 has actually spent to get this DLC Leave it in the comment section down below, ladies and gentlemen. I would love to know from you guys how much you think this pack is worth to EA Sports because they're the one who had the rights to the Porsche name, if I'm not mistaken. So, I mean, the fact... Oh, damn. The fact that we actually have this Porsche pack on Forza again is big news, man. It really is. Look at that. High-speed drifting. But let me know in the comments, though, from you guys that do have the DLC. You know, is it worth it? I mean, 500 actual gamer score we got a whole bucket list you know we have 10 cars in the pack personally this is a great dlc in my personal opinion man now let's go we got to make it there in time is the problem right now we got some great speed though 30 seconds can we make it i don't think we can man we spent too much time manji back there son of a jet could have got that just for awesome speed i guess wasn't really paying attention. More or less just Manji drifting. I don't think we're going to make it, guys. Ten seconds to get a mile and a half. I mean, good luck. We're going to get our skill points, though. And we're going to take off, though. Take care, ladies and gentlemen. Look at this. Woo! Whatever. All right. We'll do it again, man. This time, speed is the name of the game. We're going to make it sure that we get there on time with our skill score. We're just gonna do head on, man. Why not, right? Jeez. Turn right. Just one drift, one drift. That's all I want. All right, we're back on the highway. Let's go, man. Time to haul some ass. I got faith in this old girl. Well, new girl, actually. Never mind. This is my new bitch. Ooh, look at that steering wheel, though. Cornering is solid, though, I will tell you that. We gotta get some points off ASAP. Not like that, but we didn't lose them, thank God. Whew. A little scary. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Here we go. Hopefully we make it there with enough points. I mean, we should with this combo that we have building up right now. I don't see a reason why not. We should be paddle shifting right here. It's a problem. Woo! Excuse me. 8.3 miles, 110 left on the clock. Can we do it? I hope so. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Ho! We should have about 42,000 score right here. Come on, baby. Please don't hit anything is the other problem. Oh my god! We are hauling 
so much ass right now. Woo! Did I miss it? Oh, shit! Wait, this is it right here. No, no, no! Oh, that was trippy right there, man. I looked at my map. Tell me I'm going to bank it. Please. That's it, baby. That is it. Welcome to the Xander Zone, man. I don't know. I just want to say it. Number seven is a success, and we made it, man. Appreciate it. Thanks for letting me know. Hell yeah, man. 14 grand. We got 15 XP. 15 G notes, actually. Look at that. Oh, my God. Level 221, baby. What do you know about that level? Nothing. Number eight on the docket. Take a leap of faith in the Cayman GTS 2015. I have not actually driven this car yet. So this is going to be a little bit of something new today, man. Let's go, though. I'm down. All right, we are working right through these bucket list challenges. Hell yeah. Here she is, the Porsche Cayman GTS, man. I think it's the 2015 version, if I'm not mistaken. Woo! Look at her. Oh, my God. I'm breaking down all types of shit right here. All right, let's get it done, man. Number eight. We are two left from completing all 10 bucket list challenges. I don't think I've ever done that before, but we're going to take a leap of faith today, and we're going to try to get them all, man. You like how I did that? Uh-huh. Yeah, let's go. Beat the speed target. I'm down. All-wheel drive is just sucking all types of gravel up right now. A hard right. right. No lift, baby. We got a lift just a little bit. Right, screw this, man. I'm hopping this here. Oh! Jesus! We're gonna try to stick to the road to this time. I mean, I thought it was gonna be more or less, you know, a challenge to beat the time, but not at all. Woo! This girl likes to get sideways. I like it though. I don't know why I'm taking each road like it's like mandatory. Like, come on now. Now I gotta get to 140 damn miles an hour in a matter of three seconds. I don't think I can even do that. It's not happening. Not happening. Now I know there's been a lot of talk as well too about the Panamera Turbo. Uh, personally, I would have loved to see that car in the game. Um, unfortunately, it's not. I mean, we can't really cry over that. I mean, we have so many beautiful cars, including that 918 is, you know, the cover car on the pack. But yeah, I mean, I, I personally would have liked to see the Panamera Turbo come into play. Nice big old four-door kind of thing, but that's all right, though. We're hitting it. Okay. Thank you. We got this, guys. It's our time to shine with the damn Carrera. Why did I say Carrera? I don't know. And came in. All right, we got this. We're jumping it. Whoa! Yes! That's a 143, baby. 144 to be exact. And we got some serious air on that, man. Oh my god! I'm hyped about that one, man. That was huge. Whoo! Give me that XP. Give me the money. Get, wait, what? I was 221 two seconds ago. Now I'm back to 220? Turn 10. Playground. Come on. Somebody right now. Give me back my damn XP. It's not no damn game. Number 9. We are two away. Battle the elements in the Porsche 959. And it's a medium difficulty. And we're about to make history. Completing our first ever bucket list on the channel, man. All 10. I don't think I've ever done all 10 before, so this is pretty damn cool to see this coming together. And here we go. I don't know what the hell we're going to do. Race to the destination. No problem. Got to battle these damn elements, though. Okay. No, yeah. No, yeah. Okay. Thank you. Here we go. I'm just going straight right through here, man. Why did I even bother to take through there? That's stupid, man. Look at this. A clean getaway right here. And we have a wall. Maybe we should have taken that damn way. That's not good, guys. Look at this. Oh, man. We're trapped. We're trapped. Where's it opening? I see nothing. Oh, my God. We're taking the damn way again. I'm sorry. 
Easy peasy. Let's go now, man. We're gone. Take care. I'll battle the elements all day. As long as it's not a damn tornado, then I'll be a little bit scared. Oh! Jack! I'm so sorry! This is so big, I couldn't even attempt to hit that, man. If I tried not to hit it, I'd still hit it. I'm taking this right here. Look at this. This is money. Shut up, Anna! You guys don't know the right, fastest way. Oh! The rain got me! Two minutes and 45 seconds to get to this damn place. That's far. That's too damn far, almost. I'm gonna cut this right here. We are climbing hills. Can I climb this? Oh, yeah. Woo! Let's go, baby. Put this all-wheel drive to work right now. Uh-oh. No! No! Come on! Oh, we're stalling! Go, go, go! No! Come on, we had such a good run up that, man. We killed so much time. And then we just lost a bunch of it doing that stupid ass stuff. I'm curious if I can cut this. I'm gonna try it, man. We're on Horizon 2. I'm going for gold, if you will. I'm doing it. That doesn't look very damn cutting. Even if I wanted to cut that, I don't think there was even a possibility of doing so. Look at that! Easy money right now! Let's cut it even more! Woo! We're coming in with time to spare! Oh, yes! Look at that! Number 9 is a success! Appreciate it! 7100 XP? I'm, I'm guessing I'm still level 21 is what I'm guessing. Okay, no, yeah, that's, that's perfect. We got another wheel spin, we ranked up again. I, I really have no explanation for that, I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, yeah, number 10. Hear the Carrera GTS V10 engine roar at 155 miles an hour. Oh, man. I mean, I think that the 918 should have been the last one, but I will also take the Carrera GT, no problem. Look at her. Oh, that's a beautiful looking car, man. Really is. I'm ready to bang this V10 at 155. No problems with that. No problems, here we go. Look at that active arrow coming up. Ooh. It's a bit of a handful on here, I'm not gonna lie to you. Oh, what is it, 155 we gotta hit, man? That's a, that's fast. Oh, that's not gonna happen now. We're gonna wheelie it, though. Come on. Ah, uh, we're definitely not getting it. Definitely not getting this. Slowly going up. Slowly. Come on. 155! Oh, we got 151. Oh, we're four miles an hour slower. We got this, though, man. All we need to do is come through there without touching that wall to start us off. And we got a little bit caught in trouble. But this one, this one should be it. I don't see any reason whatsoever why we cannot bang this speed trap out and finish this bucket list off. I really don't. As long as we can drive, man. That's the only thing. If we can drive. Oh, hello. Look at this. Did I just right in the way? Look at- Oh, God. I told you. The key factor is if I can drive, and it's not looking good right now. There we go. In 400 yards, turn These S-Pens right. don't really matter. As long as we don't hit anybody. Keep our time up. We're good, we're good. Hold that throttle down. Fourth gear coming through, baby. Oh, yeah. Look at the speed. Look at the speed. 155, no problem. 
147, 152, 155. That is a wrap here for the Porsche expansion. We have completed all 10 bucket list challenges for the Porsche Pro Achievement for completing all Porsche bucket list challenges, man. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys once again for coming around to the channel. If you did enjoy the episode today, don't forget to slap that like button. Show me the support in the comment section down below. And as always, too, guys, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, all of which are found in the description box down below. Chibota Slap Train, Forza Horizon 2, Porsche Expansion, now available on the dashboard for $9.99. I'm out. Peace. Oh my god. What is going on everybody? It's your boy Slab Train and welcome back guys. 